Hi, I'm Jonathan Bird, and welcome to my world. Today we're going to talk about dive fins. Now there are probably as many fin designs as there are fish in the sea, so it can be a little hard when you're first getting into diving to pick a pair until you've tried a few and you know figured out what you like and what you don't. But I mean they're all essentially the same thing. It's a big giant blade that goes on your foot and they give you a lot more water movement when you kick than you would get with just your foot. So you can go faster with fins than you can without them. But, I mean, from that point on, fins diverge into many different kinds of designs. This is a very traditional flat blade design where you kick it and it, it provides thrust in both directions. Um, and, you know, this kind of fin has been used for 50 years. Little newer designs have the split design where water kind of goes through them on each kick and that's supposed to direct more of the water off the back of the blade, which gives you supposedly a little more thrust. And then there's probably the, the most advanced design of fin on the market today called a force fin. And what this fin does is it actually provides thrust only on the power stroke and gives you another half of a kick, which is the relaxation stroke. And the way it works is when you're swimming, when you kick down, the blade comes back and then snaps to give you thrust. And then when your leg goes back up, it folds up and gives you uh, easier kicking, and then it snaps, and then it relaxes, then it snaps, and then it relaxes. And this design um, lets you have more stamina because you don't get as tired wearing it. And because of the snap action, it throws the water off the back, and you get more forward thrust. So even though a force fin is a very small, compact fin, it gives you as much thrust as a much larger fin. As a bonus, you know, since it's small, you can walk up the dive ladder wearing your fins. You don't have to take them off. They're smaller to pack in your gear for flying. So this is why I really think that the force fin is the best fin on the market. But, you know, you should try a bunch of fins and see which is the best for you.